Hello. So we're now on day four. I'm doing Littleborough to Middleton now, uh, through Rochdale at Castleton. Uh, this is the longest stretch really because um, I've had to do it after finishing uni. Um, I've not really had much choice. I was hoping to come earlier in the day, but um, I had a tutorial that I forgot about. So um, I've come a bit later. We we're coming up to Lock, sorry, Bridge Number 40. Let's show you. There you go, Bridge Number 40. And then we're at Lock Number 34, which is Warland, Lower Lock Number 34. I thought you were going to say North then. So, 34. I wonder how they labelled them back in the day. There's a bike coming here, so I shall let him pass. Please save water. Close this gate first. Hold it. Closed and close the fire gate gently against it. Mm. Come on, dude. Put on your bike. I think it's about the same time as I left the other day. My, leg, my calf was hurting, so... Um, about the same sort of time that I left that I'm coming back but it's a week different so it's probably about 40 minutes earlier or so um, <laughs> it looks like I've just carried on by it interesting building let's look That in a barge. Got cars just over there as well. Got all methods of uh, transport then. So here we have number 35. Oh, number 35. Borders of counties. The sign here for attention dog owners, pick up after your dogs, thank you. Attention dogs, grow back. Cutting up to. Graham of the North. Graham of Lancashire. Oh my Graham. Don't know any Graham. Feeling that. Uh, this is cold. Long these up. So that one you don't.
Accidentally drowned in the UK in 2022. If you see someone in difficulty, call 999. The problem is, you call 999, do you? You're gonna be. What's this? Can I read that? I'll pause that and read it out when I uh, edit the video. On. I know that the video would have captured that. It really is a long way when you think of it. Not just to go on a, uh, what do you call them? Not just to go on a, on a badge, but actually, it's that guy who they said they built it. They did, they did dug it with a shunt and I did put it inside so it doesn't have a lid here. And then look it up. And then put it on the video. And then we're going to come back. I can't believe this is all the notes I've got past. First West, below West Summit, 138. First Below West Summit, that's a very strange name. First Below West Summit Lock. Not like the name it gave before, which was like George or something. Gow. Nice. 
not so much with that one. The third to the Second, the level west from it, dedicated to keep the power of the club around the shop room. was the bridge. So that means it was 40 for the lock. If you think about it, the bridges have always been about five or six ahead. But now the locks are catching up. 41 to 43. It's like rugby score, isn't it? I wonder what it'll be by the time we get to Manchester. Who's going to win? Let me know in comments below. Do you think bridges will win? Or do you think... And you can't look up online. Or do you think the um, locks will win? Comments below. I go for the locks. What's going on there? That's a shame. I mean, that looks like a really interesting building. That would make a great photograph. What's got on here? Oh, it's probably to do with the uh, demolition. I was saying it for a minute, the lot was fun. That's one thing you notice. Is the locks and the bridges are always in one piece. All working. That wouldn't have happened if they hadn't. Sorted it out. Would it? But there's some history. Lock. I forgot what lock number it was, man. What lock number was it? Because there was a name. There was no lock name. That must be 42. Even if it doesn't say it, there's no name to it. It probably says on the map. I've got my bag. Tell you what really surprises me, right? Is people are putting their um, dog poop in a bag, right? And then they're throwing it to the side. That just doesn't make sense. You should be picking up the poop because people don't want to be, you know, so it's right they put it in a bag, but then they should be disposing of it responsibly. But if you ain't, why pick it up and then just chuck it to the side? Because at least the poop is biodegradable and it will feed the earth. It's not the right thing to do. But it's better than leaving it in a bag, which will just stay in the bag. It's pointless. I don't understand it. No sense. I don't know what's going on with my hair today. I like the colour. It was supposed to be a purple, but I don't know what happened. Right, we're on lot 43. Let's go 
I wonder if the sign was behind me or not. Oh, well, it's too late now. I'll check it out in the thing. Lock number, thick one lock. This is mine then. Number 43. That does not look like a three. That We are lock number 44. I am conscious that this is in. All you hear him is lock number 41, lock number 42, lock number... So, I apologise. Slade and lock 44. So then, people I was speaking to earlier were probably going through there to meet him. Good luck. I can tell you coming into... Just a very next day. Certain style. I mean, it's still very similar to Todmorden and so on. There's the windows in the distance there. And we're coming to lock 45. Which is cold. I give up. I'm even caring now. I'm only kidding. Pedestrians, as opposed to sheep, buffalo. This is called Pike House Lock. I reckon number six is called Jail House Lock. Huh? Yeah, coming up to the Little Burr and then Smithy Bridge, then Rochdale. Today's is the longest leg. Um, probably come round here too late tonight, you know. Probably should have. I don't want to do it. Um, I need to do it tonight. Because otherwise, it's not going to be five days, and it needs to be five days. Because. You ladies not off as well. You're not off to southern Spain or South Africa or something. No? You're staying there. Lovely warm little there. Hmm? Okay. No, sorry, I'm just hush it up. As you can see from the little lips. Started to rain bridge there, but there's no number on either side, so I forgot what number we're up to, but we'll find out after the next one. I was on that train days ago. Sliced it with a knife. It's really odd. I just enjoyed them. You'd have got that little bit of extra space then. You get that. Don't look good, man. I think. Like, we don't want you part of our house. Right, we're on lock 
27. Which does have a name. It's not called JLL, I don't care if it's called Dirty Rock. That was the last one that didn't have a name. I'm going to call it JLL's Rock. Which I think mean, Rock. It tells you about dirt in there, but I'll put that up on the later. Bridge 48. Traffic jump. That's the return station. Up the restaurant. This is number 51. It's starting to um, definitely tell you again to watch Rochdale. Okay. If you Messages. So again, the bridges are going ahead again. Oh god, bunch of kids. That's what I need. Number 52. Again, no luck. So I hope maybe. Maybe the bridges are going to win after all. Uh, raining quite a bit now, so I'm coming up to Smithy Bridge. This is the longest leg. That first leg seemed quite long, but it was spread out because of the. Uh, it was spread out because of the stopping and videoing and stuff. And I knew I'd do more of that the first area in the first couple of days until I got to Tottenham, maybe even that. Um, 
still tried, as I'm going to take a moment. Just because I still can't. Math. Math, you're right. Math, math, to what? I can't mind. It doesn't matter. You know what I mean. Like uh, Eric Morkham says, playing all the right notes, just not necessarily in the right order. There's a train. Maybe he knows I'm listening. James, it's only backward. Very nice. as a bridge? Yes it is, 54A. No luck. Getting close to Roch down there. Probably about.
coming up to it's only 66 kilometers to it isn't it don't forget the monster <laughs> I'll tell you something, this found objects thing is a lot more difficult than it looks because uh, number 55 is still no box. I could be wrong. Um, you've got to remember to look for stuff. There's a cup there. Tissue. Mm -hmm. Not the mill, I'm not sure. Coming cool up to Rockstar now, very cool. And then uh, quickly through to um, Castleton. Middleton. The majority of the objects that are on the ground is rubbish, but it's like litter, uh, you know, like wrappers and bottles, and, and they're kind of meaningless because it's like, I'm not sure what that's supposed to tell anybody. from the water. Uh, some silver thing, I have no idea what it is. A feather. I did have two feathers but one vanished. Time centre. Castleton. Definitely getting closer to Middleton now. At the end of day four. And then next week we'll do day five. It's just a bathroom. Do the train again. It's for good. There is 56. I spoke too soon when I talked about the. Um, Too soon about the locks, I think. Start to come too much down there. I think that was where I am. Um, come across. Fifty eight. Say that um, until you cross the Rochdale because I have loads of teenagers opposite side of the street at the canal being rowdy and just the sounds of motorbikes just screaming around. You can probably hear them. Anyway.
so we've got a minute to Keep saying that they're close to the rocks still. But the rocks still is quite a large town, if you want to call it a town. I wouldn't make class as a city, yeah, it's a town. Um, as it structures technically from Little Burr all the way to Castleton. So, yeah, big area. Uh, coming up to bridge. Is that 58? A A, 58 A A. Not A and not B, but A A. I think that's a business actually. Number 59. I thought it was going to be 58BB for a minute. I've never, ever, ever done weed. And for a long time I didn't know what it smelled like. Um, nobody ever said to me, <laughs> and they said, do you see that smell? Do you smell that? That's weed. Nobody's ever said that to me. I think it's not till my 30 plus, maybe. But um, I kind of put two and two together and tunnel there just absolutely stunk of weed. This is what I think is weed anyway. This is what I think is weed. I don't know if you heard that, it said low power. Kind of speaks volumes though. Right, we've come up to a lock. Finally. Probably about seven kilometres away from Middleton now. And where I'll be stopping recording at anyway. the end of day four. Charming. is Moss Upper Lock 49. A lot of good feet in the water here, but it's not the best of areas. Technically, 
the bridges are way ahead. Because if you think about it, they've been doing A, B, A, A. If you count each bridge as an individual bridge, which I'll do at some point, is way more. This is a really weird way of... Up there. I have walked it that long one. We watched Del Town Centre's just down there. So there's receipt here, which is just past Rochdale. I'm going to go in the back. One bridge, and I somehow need to get over this road. Sixty-two. I feel like I've missed some. I've not. They've been done for a very long time. Hmm. Sixty-two. Hey. Why? Why not sixty-three? Or as it probably would be eighty something. We're at 63 bridge, but you can't see the number because it doesn't let you get to it. So what you've got to do now, this is a bit that they couldn't, they couldn't uh, allow, allow you to go under. So you've got to go around this building here. This point, we're at about four kilometres back now. Five kilometres, haven't we? Maybe I'm on the inside. Anything coming? This is. You've got to go under the motorway bridge, you see. Which doesn't count as a canal bridge, by the way. Must be somewhere. No. Just assume it's a capital bridge. Was it 63? This is 63. That's probably 62 triple A or something. The previous one. Light come on, what's that? We 
we've got lock 51 of which I can't see a name for and 64 very close to the Middleton part now, the end of day four. Um, I'll tell you, my shoulder, it, left shoulder is absolutely killing me. I feel like I've been shot, not that I've ever been shot. That's how I'd imagine it would be. Um, and um, my legs are actually not as bad as I thought they'd be. So, we're up to the end of day four. Uh, there's a little bit left to go. A few, few more kilometres, probably about three. Just under three, maybe. Just come through Castleton there. That was Castleton Bridge. Uh, so, fairly close. Uh, I've had a little bit of some snack, some water. But I am absolutely starving, so we glad to get back. Interesting. Graffiti on the wall. Got a train there. Heading, no doubt. Rochdale, Little Borough, possibly through to Salvi Bridge, maybe even Leeds. And I won't be on that one again for a while. Didn't catch a number on that. I'm guessing it had one. 64? Maybe. Another train? There is one there. A is that or 65B? Maybe you can zoom in on the video. My legs are getting all wet there. Oh, let me come in and to another one. away as well but the but it's classed as the M60 really Let's see what this is do you know what? I've run through this so many times before I moved to Sweden. Never took any notice of the numbers. I'm doing now, obviously. It's 
is this one? 65B. Lot number 53, which is called. Did they stop name, naming them at this point? I can't see a name anywhere. Not even on this side. Anyway, lot 53. And we've got a bridge as well, which is. <laughs> Why not? 65C. We've not used a C yet. I'm not sure what the classifications are. About one kilometre away from the end of day four. And then the next day will be day five, which will be from Middleton from when I finish basically. Middleton all the way to Manchester. And this is going to be tricky trying to get over this because they, um, this is just going to be so muddy. I'm definitely going to need a shower when I get back. Usually when you're running across here, you can just hop and you just kind of hop and skip over them. But when you're walking, you can't really. Do, well, maybe you can. You have to. Oh. Oh, yeah. oh, still got me. Still got me. I was filming from the train going past there a few days ago now. And I've videoed over here. Of course, it was a lot brighter then. Right. Coming up to Middleton now. Technically in Middleton, actually. Are we? Might still be classed as Castleton, but it's on the verge of Middleton, of, uh, Castles, of Middleton. Um, so we are, we are at the end of day four. It got dark, didn't it? Um, coming up to a lock now, we'll check the lock number. Um, I don't think we'll get to see the bridge number because... Um, I'm, I'm going out before we get there. Um, and um, we'll check it on the day on day five. When I start the walk from the middle to which you'll be from this, this point. Um, so we'll have a look at the we'll have a look at it then. See what's what see what number it is. So we're coming to our last lock of the day. I think it's the last one in my This 54, is it? 
ran past this so many times. This is only about a kilometer and a half from my parents' house in uh, Middleton in England. 54, and again, no name. So it's, it seems that it's the little borough onwards that, caught, that have uh, the name of the locks. We've got a bridge 66. Seen that number a lot today, haven't we? I don't think it helps with the um, flash of card room. <laughs> a bit of a spin then. Right. Wow. Warm, warm one. There's a pub there. Take the ship in. This is lock 55. But I can't see the um, the number for the for the bridge. But we'll check that. We'll check that on uh, day five, as because I'll be entering day five for some time in the morning. And it'll be over there, we'll be going down. So I'll say what the, the number is. So thanks for watching. Um, day, day, um, that's watching day five, uh, day four, sorry. Right. Um, Uh, which was it's kind of little bit of a little bit it's a long way that actually it's not a surprise that the sun's gone down uh, thanks for watching anyway hope it's been interesting with a few, a few interesting chats over the few days um, and I will see you on day 5 for the final leg of this and then in November, I will be heading to Sweden to do something there. The idea is just to go to the Jöte Canal, which is near Gothenburg, and do something similar and compare the canals. Uh, so for now, I'll say goodbye. I'll see you on day five. Bye.